Hi guys. As you probably know, this man here, Michael Napodano, recently sent me a package. I knew there was a package coming, but I wasn't sure about the contents of it. Well, Michael was one of the main designers of Harvester, so the package was full of treasures. It says Town. The script of Harvester. Cinema stuff. Agency directory. I'm going to share those treasures with you guys, and I'll start with the agency directory. The characters of Harvester were real people filmed in front of the green screen. There's a huge variety of characters in the game, which means they needed a huge variety of actors and actresses. Some of the actors were the same people who were making the game. For example, the writer and director Gil Austin did the role of Mr. Moynahan, and the artist Tim Higgins did the role of the chess master. You don't have to be Johnny Depp to do acting like that, but some of the roles required real acting skills. Some of the roles also required some special qualities, like big muscles or being a 50-year-old woman. It's not an easy job to find the right people to do the roles, and that's why there are casting agencies. According to the manual, the credit for the casting goes to the company named Peggy Taylor Talent. And this is of course the agency directory of that company. The agency directory contains 80 pages, and it's divided in four sections. Women, men, girls and boys. Let's start from the beginning and check out who were the lucky ones who ended up in Harvester. And already second lady here is familiar to us. Mary Allen. You recognize her? You should, because she's the loving mother of Steve. She's also Mrs. Potsdam, Stephanie's mother. Hello, Sheriff. Mrs. Potsdam here. Also, every PTA mom is Mary Allen. I'm not sure, but she also might be the blind woman in the post office. I can see a resemblance, but I can't be sure. I knew Mary Allen before Harvester was released. Sort of. Monty Python and the Holy Grail is one of my all-time favorite movies. There's a scene where Sir Galahad, played by Michael Palin, enters Castle Anthrax which is full of young, beautiful virgins. Mary Allen is one of those girls. I don't know which, because there are so many of them, but there she is. Somewhere. Back to the agency directory. The next familiar face here is the actress of Stephanie, Lisa Kange. 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 Something. That's an Italian name, and I have no idea how to pronounce that. So, I'll say it like a Finn. Kangelosi. Lisa Kangelosi. 5 feet 4 inches, size 4, blonde hair and blue eyes. Singer, actress, dancer and model. Hmm. Before Harvester, Lisa was a lead singer and dancer in Up With People tour. And during that time, she lived here in Finland too. So in theory it's possible that I have seen or even met her as a kid. Man can always hope. After Harvester, Lisa continued her career in show business. You can find more details about that in Internet Movie Database. When I had an interview with Lisa, she told me that she had received more fan mail from her role in Harvester than any other acting jobs combined. I'm glad to hear that. And I hope she'll receive even more fan mail in the future. Wink wink. Lisa told me also that she didn't do her own voice acting in Harvester. I think that's strange, and I don't know who did the voice acting. Anyway, Lisa had to speak out every letter of the alphabet, so they could get the video shot of her mouth moving in all different patterns. Like this. And... This is what they made her say. I want you to make love to me. If you want to read the full interview, and I know you do, 
Check out Harvester fan page on Facebook. Click more, then notes, and there you go. The role of Stephanie is the most demanding role in Harvester, and you can't do it better than Lisa. She's just fantastic. Too bad she's not acting anymore. As far as I know, this is the last time she's been in front of the camera. Hi, I'm Lisa with Mattress Sleep Centers with a holiday message. It's easy to get caught up in the hustle and bustle of the season. Remember to take time and enjoy it, and don't forget what the season is all about. Merry Christmas from your friends at Mattress Sleep Centers. Yes, mattresses. I'm thinking of a spinal cord too. One more thing. Lisa was in Who Wants to Be a Millionaire in 2012. Unfortunately, she didn't become a millionaire, but I would love to see that episode. The next one here is Persis Forster. These days she looks like this. You know who she is? Persis Forster, also called as the Wasp Woman, is the owner of Miss Percy's Studio of Dance slash Performing Arts. She established that in 1954, so she sure knows how to dance. It would have been great to see the Wasp Woman dancing. Back to the agency directory. The next one here is Roxanne Loveset. She did the role of Edna Fitzpatrick, the owner of Edna's Diner. I mean, DNA's Diner. Like we all know, Edna hangs herself and her little daughter Karin, which is pretty disturbing. Roxanne Loveset did another role too, and it's even more disturbing. But for some reason it's not mentioned in the credits. Can you guess which role it might have been? Hmm? And some mothers complain that their children don't come to see them. Mm, mommy, you're so good. You're so good. Yes, she is the mother. This is the most notorious scene in Harvester. The cutscenes where kids are eating their mother were censored in Europe. Too bad, because you can see they really did put an effort in making that scene. The next one here is Doris McClellan. I hope I said that right. We all remember her as Mrs. Phelps. My stars, that's scandalous! She was also the librarian in the lodge. This is a library, not a brothel. Unfortunately, that's all I can tell about her. Then, here's Karen Sexton. Oh, what a sweet looking lady. I wonder who she might have been in Harvester. Oh yes, she's the teacher in Game Memorial. She's even more frightening than the teachers I had. Brings back memories. That bridges the generation gap quite nicely. Karen Sexton was also the madame in the lodge. I'd be sure to get to a doctor if I were you. Okay. There were all the women. There's still men, girls and boys left, but this video ends up here. Do you want more? Well, more videos? Don't mind if I do. I thought so. Thanks for watching.